going on everyone? This is Mr. Mathur with another tutorial talk. What's up everyone? This is going to be a short little tutorial video to help you out with your SAQ strategies. So the first thing you want to do is read the question that's being asked. So you can have a general understanding of what's being asked and the vocabulary inside the question so you can make sure that you understand what's going on. The second thing that you want to do is obviously read the story. When you're reading the piece of literature that they're asking you to read, be sure to use your reading strategies such as steel for characterization and twist just for an overall um, understanding of what's going on in the text. After that, you can refer back to the question um, and then maybe jot down some notes in the margin, underline some stuff, highlight some stuff, just all your reading strategies that you do. Once you have a general understanding of what's going on, then you can follow the strategy of A, P, and E. So the A is basically, you just want to make sure that you are answering the question that's being asked, all right, and not some off the wall thought that you may have had. And that goes back to the notes that you've taken um, when you were reading uh, in your pre-notes uh, that you were taking before you start uh, writing. Uh, the second thing is the proof, and the proof is just a quote from the story. That's any line from the story that you have that supports the answer that you have. So and the last thing is the explanation, and this is where everybody tends to just fall short of making that three that you can make, that everyone has the potential of making on a, when you're answering a short answer cue. And, um, so, or short answer question. And this is explain how the quote supports your answer. So what you wanna do is explain how this supports this, all right? And as an overall, the answer comes from you. The proof comes from the text and the explanation comes from you. So make sure the sentence comes from your brain, you steal from the text, and then the explanation comes from your brain. If you can do that, then you're guaranteed to make at least a two or that wonderful three um, as far as scoring is concerned on, the, on your uh, SAQs. But if you have any questions, as always, you can always tweet me, uh, email me or email me on Canvas, or just ask me in class. Uh, you know, I'm always available. Um, but I hope this helps out. Uh, and like I said, if you have any questions, just ask away.